What's going on, young world? Welcome to Pretty Boss TV. If you have not already heard, Atlanta has one of the highest epidemic rates of HIV in the nation right now, okay? 66% of all HIV cases come from Atlanta. One in 51 Georgians will be diagnosed with HIV in their lifetime, and Atlanta is the epicenter of the Southern epidemic. Down South has the highest risk of all HIV rates across the country. Atlanta is as bad as uh, Zimbabwe or Harare or, you know, or, or Durban. Emory's Dr. Carlos Del Rio compares Atlanta's AIDS problem to third world countries. The highest risks come from D.C., Maryland, Georgia, Florida, and Louisiana. Men who have sex with other men have a 1 in 6 risk of catching HIV. For heterosexual men, the risk is 1 out of 473 men. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says if you live in the southeast, you're more likely to be diagnosed with HIV than any other part of the country. In Georgia, the risk of diagnosis leaps to 1 in 51. Well, I live in Georgia, and when I heard those statistics, I had to do a video about it. I was like, you know, this is crazy. I know a lot of people who go to Atlanta. I know a lot of people who have moved to Atlanta. When I was going to college, I remember living in Georgia, and I was like, you know what? As soon as I get old enough to go to college, I'm going to Atlanta. I was supposed to go to Georgia Tech. I went. Georgia Tech's right there in the middle of Atlanta. Beautiful building, beautiful school. But, you know, I just, when I got there and I saw that literally it was slapped in the middle of downtown, like for some reason, I just didn't want to be there anymore. You know, um, a lot, I feel like Atlanta has a very sexual culture. You know, yes, you can make money. Yes, there's a lot of business going on in Atlanta, but there's a lot of dark businesses going on in Atlanta. So this isn't to bash Atlanta or anything like that. This is just to say, keep your eyes open. You know, down south has the highest rate of HIV cases, period. That's something to think about. And then when you're talking about a lot, most of the HIV cases in Georgia, 66%, which is over half, are in Atlanta. Okay, so that's crazy. You know, you know how many other cities are in Georgia and 66% of the HIV cases are in Atlanta. So, you know, I did a video about why I'm celibate. I didn't even talk about HIV and STDs, but that's definitely something I probably should have put on a video. You know, you have to protect your own body. You only have one body to live in. This is your temple. When you talk about wanting to have kids in the future, wanting to have a family, wanting to have a long, healthy life, I'm pretty sure you never thought about HIV being in that picture. People who catch HIV never thought that it would be them one day. That's not how it works, okay? Anybody can get it. So you have to really protect yourself. A lot of times the people who you trust, the people that you think, okay, I can have unprotected sex with this person, are the people who ends up being the ones to give you the HIV. You know, most of the time when people have a one-night stands, a lot of times people will protect themselves. But when you're dealing with somebody who you love or somebody who you think you can trust, you have unprotected sex, those are the people who you get the HIV from. So, you know, these are just things to think about. You know, um, I know a lot of people, I know a lot of fellas, I know a lot of men, and a lot of men are very sexual. And this is not just to put it on the men, because you have a lot of women out here having a lot of sex, too. But you heard the rates. And the rates are much higher for men because not only do women have to deal with men cheating with cheating on them with other women, but now we have to also deal with men cheating on them with other men because a lot of these men don't consider themselves gay and they think that having sex with another man is just a sexual preference and it's not actually being gay. You know, a lot of men are wanting to straddle the fence of having a normal looking life with a woman, but they're actually dealing with men on the side. You know, so I would just say protect yourself. I just wanted to put those statistics out there because I thought that was crazy. I was just having a conversation with my brother and we were talking about them types of things the other day. But I had no idea how high the rate of HIV cases were in Georgia. So definitely protect yourself. You know, let me know what y'all think about it. Let me know how you protect yourself. This is definitely a conversation that we need to be having. I'll be coming back with another video soon. Thanks for tuning in to Pretty Boss TV. Peace.